So I literally found this film, developed it, and I said, I didn't recognise any of these people. So I ran downstairs going, you know, mum, dad, who are these people? They were like, don't recognise them. Who, who and we all standing around here going, uh, this is quite creepy. We don't know, <laughs> no idea. Woke up a couple of days ago and found all these messages on my phone. And this lady called Lindsay had been going, that's my dog, that's my dad, that's me, on all of the photos. A friend that I went to primary school with, she tagged me and wrote, Lindsay, you're in these photos. I was sort of just expecting it to be some old ones from when we were kids or something. And I was like, oh, okay, well, that's my dad and my brother, and that's my dog, and that's me. <laughs> it was, uh, yeah, it was really, really strange. Hello. Hi. <laughs> The weird thing is, the camera's nowhere to be seen, but it must have been, the camera must have gone from us to her because there were her photos on the end of, like photos of her house, her kitchen on the same roll as photos of our kitchen, <laughs> weirdly enough. We just cannot figure out, for love and money, how we got the film. I mean, it's still a mystery. I don't know if we'll ever actually figure out how it got from Lindsay to us. I think I'll definitely keep asking questions, but Same. Yeah. I'm not sure we'll I'm not sure we'll figure it out though. I just in, unless somebody can magically enter the path. Like if we need a time travel traveller basically to solve this at the point this point. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's probably the only way that we're gonna <laughs> find out.